Well, good evening, everyone. Welcome to the Cosmic Tune-Up Happy Hour here on October the 16th on this beautiful new moon with my fabulous guest this evening, Anastasia, who really cool how this all came together in divine timing of what she did yesterday. And just, I'm so excited to bring her on. But before I do, you know, I have a few things that I have to do first, which the first is I love to start out with a quote. Uh, Cause right now, you know, we're talking about the grandmother energies and what's changing in the world and what's coming through. And I felt, saw this beautiful quote and I really needed to share it tonight. And what it says is when the wisdom of the grandmothers is heard, the world will heal. And it's a Native American prophecy from that. And we're going to talk about the grandmothers and bringing that energy in and that those teachings that need to come into the world this evening and clearing out old energy. And who knows what the hell is going to happen tonight? We are just going with the flow. We're going to have fun. And just, just, just what it is is what it is because that's the energy we're moving into. To have fun, to be in that inner child, to be in that joy-filled love of who we are, going inside and creating a new world. And... The only way to do that is go within, to have fun, be there, be with yourself, learn yourself, and challenge yourself. So I'm going to read a poem that was gifted to me last week when a dear friend of mine had transitioned on to the next plane. And the moment I found out, this, this poem came to me. And I sat with it after. And as I was sitting with it, and this is a challenge I invite all you cosmic explorers to do this week. To sit with something that comes into your awareness or something that comes to you and look at it from one point of view on why it came to you and then expand up to another level to look at it a different point of view and a different point of view and a different point of view. So this poem came to me as a message from my, my, my beautiful friend who passed, John Block. And then also I'm looking at it and I'm noticing how much when you expand into what it's truly about how it's what's happening in the world right now, what we all need to do, how the old beliefs are falling away and the old dogma and everything's just kind of collapsing all around us right now, which is absolutely beautiful because that makes room for new growth. So everybody just put your hand on your heart for a minute and just take a deep breath and ground yourself in and just listen to my beautiful poem, Much Obliged. The wind that wisps to worlds unknown the sparkle on snow that will always glow, the cry we fill inside our hearts, the warmth, the love that is now apart, apart from you, apart from me, the magic warmth we cannot see, a warmth inside of love moved on to another light beyond, however, never gone, a heart that will grow to shower more, Move love onto all that. Listen to the call. The call to open and receive. The unconditional love that is all you are meant to be. For when we move on, we give back to thee. A love that is true. The love within thee. Thank you for being the love that now we can all carry as we move on to grow and become the heart of our soul. So just breathe that in for a second. And I was very honored to share that and thank you for everybody receiving it. And just remember that little lesson. It's all about finding the love within us now. And, it, and there's no stopping now. It's the love that's moving forward. And that's why we all come together. And that's also why I'm so excited to have this beautiful, amazing guest I have this evening all the way from Australia. And I did bring, and I brought a piece of Australia with me, of Virginia Art. So I'm anchored into Australia as well this evening. As she did a beautiful transmission yesterday for everybody who was able to listen to it on anchoring an energy to move out all energies. And uh, tonight we're kind of gonna continue with that, bringing in this new moon energy and whatever comes. I want to tell you real quickly, this amazing divine goddess, I actually, last week, we connected for the first time. I had watched her on and off for years and wasn't really, I guess, ready to receive her full and complete. And last week, I had an up level and I reached out to her and we connected. And here we are now in this beautiful time on this new moon. 
in Australia yesterday. She did on the same day as we're doing this today, which is pretty cool. So we're time traveling. We're moving. We're shaking. We're who knows what we're doing. We're just creating magic. And that's what we need to do. So further ado, I am going to bring on the fabulous Anastasia to join us and tell us a little bit about herself and see what happens. Okay. Are you there, sweet love? Mm -hmm. Absolutely, I am. Hello from Oz. Hello. Welcome. Welcome <laughs> to the Cosmic Tina Papier. And I want to say real quickly, hello to everyone that's um, on uh, um, tuning in on the side, sending messages and everybody. So sending out love to all you for joining us this evening for this beautiful, magical Connecting Sisterhood event. Well, thank you for asking and, and having me as well, because when you emailed me, um, as you said, I wrote to you and said, I've been waiting for you. Um, you can actually handle this divine energy space and that I'd shifted away from talking with others because of transmitting so many energies and it was just a breath of fresh air because unconditional love is unconditional love, isn't it? It is. It is. And <laughs> You know, a lot of people don't really understand it. And, and that's what no, it's they really don't. and that's what we really need to grow into right now is learning. I and felt it. I felt that. where you were coming from. Yeah, I felt where you were coming from. And what you said about before about those cosmic energies and the cosmic heart. And I was working in with your energy and, and I was saying, and we need to link that to our heart in the human being consciousness to have a cosmic and a consciousness in the human being. And for us to remember to bring that in and feel, and I need to bring that energy in through right now. It's coming down like a golden beam coming down the crown chakra with all of us right now in a new you, unity energy for all of us being here together as a first time is so powerfully magical making a new league of energy from australia oz to the united states of america is a new rainbow bridge connection so it's here just now that's it it's in place right now that has just happened beautiful and that is how we create by showing up yes seeing feeling breathing the, that's a visual that came and as we speak that's how we grow. We need to come together and talk more like you and I are. So thank yeah. you because we're bringing up a brand new platform together, you and I. So thank you very much. Thank you as well. And that's that's what it's all about, being true and not um, in your truth and in your talk and how you feel and not being afraid anymore to say something. And, you know, because I, I think when I first contacted you, I was, I was completely raw and honest and that, you know, I love, that's what I love, raw, real, vulnerable, and just let it all hang out. And, you know, I'm, I'm feeling now, no, 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 about you, you know, the people that aren't there or don't understand that energetically, they're not there. And that's okay, too. Well, yes. And like what you just said for me, what it was, was I said to you straight up after being on other radio shows and bless all souls, everybody has their role and purpose in, in, in whatever someone is bringing to the planet. I don't work with anyone personally. It's all energy for me. And it takes all that, um, egoic mind bullshit out of it when I work with energies and it's a very freeing because I actually have freedom and and we're bringing in new freedom energies yeah. with um the solar plexus of the world with Uluru one of the 21st of the 12th and and um yesterday for me was my 16th which is yours yeah. where we brought in a, a brand new ending of the karmic cycle energies and it was the beginning of shifting for a new cosmic abundance yes and that beautiful art by Truth Rebel Art Felix that was created for today. Wow. Yes, thank you so much. And that should have been right before we started um, showing that. So I hope everybody had the opportunity to kind of breathe and feel into that beautiful, magical, like multi dimensional layered healing. Yes, it will open you up to the cosmic abundance energies. It's bit by bit. Nothing is going to happen like that. But what's happening is the biggest changes of our times are happening right now, shifting from third dimensional energies. The split was made very recently. So, you mm -hmm. know, this is really, really happening. And, and we're all a part of this and how blessed are we? Yes. And it's beautiful to be part of it. And it's 
it's so beautiful to connect to you and just and all these beautiful people that are watching us here tonight. I mean, my heart is just so full. And I, you know, before the show tonight, I was just, you know, all the energies I could just feel, you know, talking about the Rainbow Bridge we just brought in, like I was pre into it. and I was like, oh, my gosh. And I literally had to sit there and breathe in and really ground myself into this new up level energy. And I think that's, you know, for everybody out there, this up level is coming to stand in who we are. And we really need to focus in and feel and feel. And we need to feel. So as we say, I think, is to start consciously being aware of what we say, I think, and we shift it to I feel. And if we do that, that will remove a block that many have with the mind from feeling and saying the word, I think we are, rah, rah, rah. If we then notice, I just said, I think. So if we start consciously monitoring how we speak and shift it in that moment, your whole life can change in one instant. Many souls actually blocking themselves at the moment with their third yeah. eye in their mind and i spoke about this in the live yesterday third eye in the mind are flicking back and forth so they're getting answers but they're not so they're doubting themselves and that's because yeah. they, they're coming from the egoic mind and so and there's a beautiful healing yesterday on blue beyond guide facebook page um and that energy is still coming through here so just in what you said i too uh, my night i worked all night with your energies it was weird all i can say is as i was resting and sleeping in preparation because it's my now 10 11 a.m here and it was very unusual weird 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 and i'm like there's a very heavy unusual weird energies clearing to the states just clearing the energies with our country so it was just yes can I say fucking phenomenal? It is fucking phenomenal. And, you know, connecting to where I am, anchoring and where I am, I don't know, you know, I do this show from Jacksonville, Florida, and I'm like right down the road from St. Augustine. So pretty much everything in the freaking United States started right mm -hmm. here in this area where I am. So what a perfect place to ground this new energy, to move out that old shit, because living here, it is old stuff that wants to go. It has been calling out and just saying, we are ready to move on. We are ready to move on. I've been feeling it for a while. And so thank you. Um, yeah. Can that I do an up. earth dragon? Can I bring some earth dragon energy through right now with that vision of what you just yes. shared? Bring it all in, girl. Clear this out. Oh, somebody's close to West Palm. They're probably feeling it too. <laughs> Well, we're going to do it right now together. Yes. To show how simple it is when we focus our conscious intent. This is a global healing happening right now. Here, you are part of, mm -hmm. of the earth dragon. I'll let that vision come in for a bit. Please your path and the land around you. Stay grounded, be ready to serve. Stuck energy is clearing. You can move forward in life. This came before we came on, just before. That was the one that popped out ahead, ready to show you. I'd love to share that. What I share with my energy, you said at the beginning, share a little bit briefly about myself. Well, I'll just share little bits here and there. And I'll share one little bit about myself here is that I am given the answer before you ask the question. Mm -hmm. The card was given to me before this came for me to bring through. When I work with people one-on-one, -on -one, I will give them the answer at the beginning and then we'll come right round and I'll go, and that was what I said to you when I very first met you, people go, I, so what I work with is what's called the below the iceberg energies of 25 years, quarter of a century, being in that dark energy, bringing through a new path for humanity through myself Firstly, for the planet as a human template in linking spirit and soul through our emotions, that is my role. Namaste. What a blessing and honor it is to be here with you too. Because I'm also Anastasia myself, like you, that's here in the planet and working in unity and bring energies through. Yet I have two energy sources, one in spirit and soul, and I'm two in one. So it's quite a powerful energy space for someone to hold. Yes. To be able to sit in these energies. And I've been hiding myself for many years too. Like you said to me, you were as well. So thank you again for the platform for us to share together, okay? Because we 
just being the hiokas. We're just winging it. We're just, you know, I've shared before, stop before you're ready. Because you're ready and you're ready and you just got to catch up with yourself and faith and trust with yourself that you got this, that you're strong enough, that what you've already been through is worse than what you're going to go from here because the worst has happened already. You've got, you've got this. We are making a difference and a change. Yes. This is really real. And more souls are now writing that in comments. This is, I'm just crying. Because this really is happening. This is real. Yes, <laughs> it is real. It is here. It just wasn't the way we thought it was going to be. The thoughts is what attracts people. It just is not. Didn't happen the way I thought it was going to be, of doing things differently myself. But I had to ban and let that go. We've shifted timelines. We are now at the forefront. We've got to come and speak up and voice up yes. to bring the new platforms out. There's no one else left to wait for. There's no one coming. It's us. And that, when that dawns on you, and you can do it together in unity, the only way this planet is going to send is new unity energies with love and yeah. our consciousness. Yes. And I, I want to add to that too. It is the beautiful foundation that we are showing right now of the divine feminine energies that of co-creating together to make each other better and to be together. And it's not about male and female it has nothing to do with that. And so I, I really want people out there that are listening to realize that it's not about the physical. It is about the divine feminine energy that's rising up that we need to connect together to support each other, to allow people to have their own points of view, to allow people to be who they are, no matter what, with no judgment and see them in the place of love, in the space of love at the higher being they truly are. Aligned and that takes a while to grow through. That takes a yes. while. I'm going to add the below the iceberg as you speak. Go right ahead. What you bring through, I would like to bring the below the iceberg and I'd like us to link it live together. Yes, let's do it. We flow so smooth together. <laughs> There's an energy shifting right now. Mm hmm to be able to do that with others means we need to unconditionally love ourselves. Yes. And that takes a while to clear and to come to for oneself, especially right now. So what we're saying and you're saying is the overall yes. You've given yes, that's the overall. And I'm saying the ground crew is saying this has taken a little bit longer than we expected. Mm -hmm. We've got to the rest of the year. And then on the 21st of the 12th, ascension is a process. Mm -hmm. Today is a big stepping stone because we need to link our spirit and our soul. We need to link the cosmic with the human, grounded, emotional, feeling, conscious awareness is the only way we're going to send forward. And that's true. So we need to take in different sources of information because we're multidimensional, multifaceted. Thank you. You have an incredible healing energy. I've never experienced anything. I'm not really into any noises or any sort of things with any sort of language as anyone does. But when I heard and felt you, when I felt you do what you did the other day, I went, oh, you just cleared all negative energies. That's a first. No one's ever done that with. So thank you for that. It's quite, I've never experienced anything like that before. That's the first. It's, Thank you. Whew, I'm feeling it saying it's clearing me. You're you're super master powerful. <laughs> Woo -hoo! I'm out of the bubble, girl. I'm out. Woo -hoo! <laughs> and we are the silliest. Oh, people, you know, and I want to start with people. You know, some people are saying major root chakra palpitations, all energy centers are pulsing. So everybody's good, feeling good. it. How beautiful is that? Good, 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 uh, good girl. I got you. What did I say? What did I say in here earlier when we were talking about sharing about Felix and the art? And you said it was really good that you mentioned about Felix. And I went, oh, and I wrote, it just came beautifully from my higher self, my soul. Oh, always. We never leave family behind. We are of tribal from the originals, Felix and I. Yes. Well, we always, we're here to promote each other. The ego and the jealousy and the competition in the spiritual world is rife. Let's send that It's not about out. names, it's energies. We're not going into names, personal stuff. The energies, whatever, and bless them. Because the end of the karmic cycle, we're moving on. 
from that. And with 888 in the picture that was shown and 777, we didn't get any further with this dragon. I've got to keep going. Okay. With the 777 and the 888 energies, you're going to reap from ending the old karmic energies. This is the healing today in the message. The cosmic abundance is newly coming through at the same time with everything else. It, yesterday grounded it in the live I did on the Facebook Blue Beyond Guide and on YouTube Blue Beyond Guide that, that live. I will reshare it again with another picture. Today, here today, anchoring this into the US as well. See it go underneath your feet and see energy travel under your feet and zoom out and you're doing it. That's it. Feel that connectedness. Yes. And push that golden energy down through you. And up through your crown and down through you, down into Gaia and everywhere. Yourself, your home, your family, your town, your country, your state. See the map of America and do your country right now. And then zoom the picture back even further and see that explode. Boof, the old energy off planet Earth there. Yes. And that's a guided visualization meditation that we've just done globally. Each time we get together, I'm going to make every single one count. This is my thing, girlfriend. If I may take the little step up. Thank you, madam. May I take a step up and get on the little podium for a moment? Sister, you do what you want. This is your time. I'm going to have to call oh. you up at 9 o'clock. That's all. Oh, that was fun. That's all. I'm good. I had fun sharing all that. Oh, I thought you were not even started yet. I was, but the energy <laughs> just shifted, so it was a release. See, as I talk, new growl code energies come through when I speak, and that was discovered yesterday in the live because I carry mm -hmm. the Holy Grail template for humanity with Christ energies inside of me physically. Mm -hmm. I was born for this role and mission. Yes. It's a pretty big thing that's taken me a little while to grow into, to hear, to help others, to see how amazingly masterful and, and powerful they are. Yes. And everybody out there is a master. They Everyone has the potentiality, whether yes. they do or not. Um, Stepping into it. You know, can you feel energy going crazy? I'm just going to take a moment. Yeah, I can feel energy going crazy. I got, I got, I'm just going to slow it down. I'm just going to sit back and just take a moment. So. There you go. Ooh. You know, our cosmic abundance is ourselves. Mm -hmm. And I shared a, a video and a healing in the past of I am abundance. To say and feel that to oneself, I am I abundance, am. and you can feel it. feels mm -hmm. really good to do that. And it's really exciting that new cosmic abundance is coming through with the 777 and the 888 energies. Did you want me to read a little? What would you like to do from here, honey? I'll, I'll just, Whatever. I, I just need um, to stop for a minute. I'll, real yeah. fun. Um, I'll tell everybody last night, you know, talking about the cosmic abundance, so it seems the perfect time to bring this card out. Maybe you'll bring it out too. So last night, everyone, I kind of just drew some cards for tonight. And um, the one that came up, which is so cool. I mean, you, and the, 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 yeah, this, is how, this is how it is, people. It came the Emerald Dragon which is represented of Australia, you know? And it, I don't know if you can read, but underneath it says, brings in healing and cosmic abundance. So boom on that. Uh, here we are tonight, you know? It's it's all happening. I mean, this card came up last night for the show and it was just, it totally like just put it all together. So uh, that's what this show is all about. Well. And more. I just found... I just found something I wrote. Can I now come in with you and blend in that this is new cosmic galactic abundance breakthrough energy arriving for us to continue to face our deepest core of ancient core energies, the deepest shadow ancient family energies held deep, deep within as we go higher on the spiral 
rung of ascension. And what I shared in yesterday's live was a divine healing of what I'm seeing in people's energies and aura is trapped, dark, negative energy, old abundance attacks that's trapped in people's energy aura fields. And I brought it to people's attention because I cleared another one this morning out of someone mm -hmm. by seeing it and then you're shifting it out in a visual out of their space. And you put a, just a golden bubble around the person, it could be that simple. You can call in the Arcturians and ask them to remove any ancient, abundance, cosmic blocks. Have the intent, feel it. See if you see anything, your visions, release it. You'll feel it when it's done. So this isn't being just, you know, we, we've had to push and, 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 and dig really deep. Um, because this is ancient core stuff that we're changing the old dark for the whole planet, aren't we? It is. It is, and it's freaking amazing. I mean, it really is. It's through us. Embrace it. Everybody needs to embrace it and open to it and allow it to move through them. And, you know, as I said with the poem earlier, you know, to challenge yourself to to get yourself out of the old paradigm of thinking, to get you out of those old energies by looking at things at different levels. I think it's a wonderful way to 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 look to expand your expand yourself to open and bring that spiral to do that clearing when we can move out those energies of being stuck in that point of what we used to think or believe we or just got to have faith and trust yes so have faith and trust the biggest if we can i you know i was gonna say can i share you're gonna say yes you can so um is the, um people um have been through so much that sometimes the energies that they've been transmuting the old family energies with what they've been going through it's been so heavy there's been a lot of depression heavy energies around lately and it's been really tough on a lot of people to shift those so i'm just going to do a big healing right now for those energies and what i see is like a person in a tree and then this dark gray wispy energy around it so what we're going to do mm -hmm. It's just slightly get a fan and see that those dark grey clouds shift off gently and we bring in a blue background with this beautiful tree and there's this beautiful brown and green tree and we've just got it in a beautiful clear space I needed to bring that in right now here with us all yes everybody breathe into that There's a lot happening of energies right now. My energy is feeling all the unsettled energies. I just need to settle and stabilize because you're going to see a giant pink heart. It's Mother Mary's, you know, that beautiful big heart to settle energies down. Mm -hmm. There we go. That's it. Pink, pink washing through, pure divine, unconditional pink, pink, pink. Um, when you emailed me, I remember saying back to you from all the times that I'd been asking the energies that happened, I said, you know what? If you can handle that, you need to give me a moment to process between spirit and soul. You said, yep, I'm great at holding spaces. If you can just allow me to jump in at times when energies come in and I shift it in that moment. And if you can just give me that. And, and you said, yep, yep, yep. I went, okay, I'm in. <laughs> I have my energy boundaries because it's taken me a while to also learn to step in to my grandmaster, grandmother energies as well and learning with others' energies. And I'm a very fucking fast learner because I've been doing it for 25 years. So it's like mm -hmm. I had to go zoop, super learn. And, um, yeah, I was just straight to the point. I knew my boundaries. And I said, you can do that, that, that. And if you didn't, I knew your energy or vibration wasn't ready. You said, yep, and here we are. So it's just... And be real, be honest, tell the truth. Yeah, and that's it. And I and I and I felt that like I was like, oh, she's a little, she's she's got a wall up there. She's a little like, like you know, let, 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 let me feel her out a little bit first. So I was feeling that as well. You fucking bet I have a fucking wall. I've been attacked by some of the greatest on different, the highest platforms in the spiritual communities behind the scenes. There are a lot of not nice energies out there that are that bless them in the roles and the energies they're transmitting for the planet but it's our role to come up and under and call that energy bullshit out because it's about feeling and linking the galactic the cosmos cosmic to the feeling feeling 
feeling, feeling. You can do all you like up there, but if you ain't grounded, honey, and if you haven't come home to yourself, what is it for? And that's yeah. what I'm asking a lot of people lately and people that have been like that for years, sorry, honey, I know I finished, have now come around and said you were right. And I said, well, the divine's always right. I, I get things out of order as Anastasia, but the divine's always right and the information that comes through, I know it's real. I know it's true. Oh, it is. I, I just wanted to say you're so right. We, you know, so many people want to like, get on the ascension path and feel and like want to stay up here all the time. No, we have to be here as well and ground it balanced. in balance. Right. And who we are here, you know, as above, as below balanced in the heart of all that is. And I wanted to ask how well, uh, Vicky yeah. had a question. I wanted before it goes off the screen and I won't be able to find it. <laughs> She's at the top. Um, is the bridge between Oz and us reconnecting the old Atlantis Lemurian link? Do you have an answer for that? What a bloody great question. I Isn't like the energy of the sound of that. I love the sound of that energy. There's the treasury and late 1800s building. That's why I'm here, the energy. So I have been let known by spirit that Australia is the new Atlantis rising energies. It's nothing I've read. I work direct with spirit and that is the latest. And What you just said, I can feel, and I love it. I don't know yet. That's the first time I felt into that, and I love it. Go with what you get, let me know, and I'll let you know. That feels something happened when you said that. And that's how we feel and learn to bring things in. We sit with it and we wait and see. But for me, that felt really, really good. I need to wait and sit with things for proof so instantly. That, that's what I've got. Yeah. How beautiful. Yeah. I'll, I'll look into it. Spirit from here. Spirit will bring me bits and show me. And all I can do is tune in and tell you what I'm getting as divine truth. Yes. So consciously, in my knowledge, Anastasia, no, I'm not aware of that. Good one. Thank you. Thank you, Vicky. Oh, and Ariana, we got to say this. She's having a cosmic orgasm. So how to bring that one out. <laughs> <laughs> I'm telling you. <ya>, truth. <laughs> They're the best. <laughs> I often light up and I go, oh, was that as good for you as it was for me? Yes. Cosmic and, and I call them spiritual orgasms. Very real. I love them too. Oh, they are. Right there with yeah. you. <laughs> and we can have them all the time. You know, it's living in that joy field. And, you know, that that's, that, I mean, there's so much chaos going on right now. I mean, there really is. And it's okay. But, but it's like, I don't even know words can describe it. So just feel it. You know, the energy that that what we're what we're moving into is just as I said, we're just feel it because words cannot describe it right now. The magic that is happening. I have a vision. A vision just came as you were speaking. Can I put the vision to what you just said? Go right ahead. I love working with you. The tree that I'm speaking about, the 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 art that of the three golden coins, the three golden trees, that's a vision to hold right now. I'm hoping that each one of you saw that. All you need to see is the three golden trees, the three coins. Those elements of that picture for this show, that Truth Rebel Art Felix did, I just drew a stick figures of a tree, the words. I knew it had to be a rainbow behind the name and golden coins, and that's what Felix produced, put his energy. We work together, divine. It's a very healing, energetic, and I'm bringing that energy of those three coins right here with the three golden trees, and it's going into that cosmic abundant space above your head. It's being placed in for you to uptake for yourself. I'm not doing anything to you. I'm holding a divine space in the new golden tree energy that come of the planet that came through yesterday live for me. And in that is the three golden coins, the three golden trees. There's your cosmic abundance settling into your spirit. That's a gift. It's there for you to feel that through yourself right now. There it is. Wish it through. Woo. Everybody breathe into that. Feel and breathe. Feel and breathe in our heart and our higher heart. Feel and breathe. Heart, heart, heart. There we go. 
So that was an extremely massive big heart healing that was in a couple of stages before when I was doing about the heart and everything. I can't wait to watch this back. That was a beautiful, beautiful planetary Gaia, Mother Mary healing of the heart for the whole planet together. Two hearts, spirit and soul, Australia and the States, we have healed some major, major, darker, hidden agenda under the sea, hidden, hidden energies of the dark that we're clearing right now. Because the truth always wins, love yes, always wins, yeah. and our consciousness is the key. We need to be conscious, 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 and feel, 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 feel. Yes, That's how we ascend. Mm -hmm. And see golden roots come out from the bottom of our feet to anchor in and ground golden roots. Golden roots under our feet is really powerful to ground in because a lot of people, um, I'd, may I say, Matthew and others, I, I'd love to hear what you're finding incredible. If there's anything anyone would like to ask, I keep feeling somebody wants to ask something and I need yes. to say that. Something, can you feel that? Someone's um, needs to I ask. I can feel it. I'm walking and I'm like. Great. Everyone's feeling the, the three golden coins. Amazing. Feels magnificent. The rainbow bridge. I, I can't scroll up and down. So thank you both so much. Thank you, Felix. May all truth prevail. Yes. And Hillis was up there saying, divine, thank you for the divine connection. Thank you, everyone, for being here and being part of this because we're, we're facilitating this, but we are all doing this together. How long have we got to go, honey? We are at 8.36. So when are we finishing? How are we going energetically? We're just going to, are you going to do it aim for an hour? Um, yeah, we do it at the shows for an hour to 9 o'clock. So we can, uh, just, if anybody has any questions right now, I'd like to type in a question. I'm so unprofessional. Have you noticed how unprofessional is your show? Go, oh, what time are we finishing up, love? I'm just so living alive. in the fly. Well, well, it could be, yeah, the time. This we don't work in linear time, so it's like, what are we doing again? And just see, I have to consciously anchor in and focus and ground on the human physical linear time because I work with so many energies, and that's what I'm encouraging others to learn to do in your consciousness. Yes, because we could be here for five minutes, and five hours have gone. You know how it goes. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah. We so we've got to constantly, constantly be conscious. Hey. We got a congratulations from Restream. We've received 100 messages today. How cool is that? <laughs> oh, here's a question. Hillis says, how are the blue rays emerging? I saw it. I saw oh, no. it. Um, how are they? I'm not sure what he means by how are they. It's um, is it how they're coming, coming home? To I have an answer. I have an answer. Okay. It's about coming home to yourself in the way of when I first read, when Shakina very first put it out about Blue Rays, I was very closely moving along with her with what I'm bringing through as well. And the same as you with your light language and what Shakina does, mine is my voice speaking, the, the new grail code up light grades for the planet come through me as I voice and speak. It's incredible to know that when you speak, it's an instant upgrade for people when they listen. Yes. It, it, it's it's. I'm still wrapping my head around that one. It's pretty, pretty interesting. Um, it, it's how it works. It's all about to the consciously and the human accept that's the truth. What happens when I speak in voice? Their holy grail code upgrades instantly when I voice and talk. Yes, because you're sending pretty up powerful a powerful that. Well, I only consciously got that on another level yesterday. Yes. Yeah. So I got on spiral. We're moving to that spiral yeah. of learning the language of vibration yeah, exactly. that our bodies like, are. Well, mm -hmm. yeah, yeah, more is being revealed to me of things I've known for 25 years, darling. And what's happening for me is I knew it, I lived it, but I didn't understand it fully like I am now. This keeps happening to me more and more. I've got so much more. I was saying yes, I've got so much more to share with you all to reveal. I do the same stuff. <laughs> Thanks so, so much, Oh, that's what that, that, that meant. <laughs> yeah, so Hila said, yes, how are they coming in? Um, um, when you look at the description for the Blu-rays from Shekinah, I've also written about it. When you read and feel into that and go, oh, I'm a Blu-ray and feel into it, it's all the years that we've been transmuting behind the scenes as Blu-rays. You will not read this in a book. 
because I'm living words and Spirit chose for me not to write books so the energy would not be corrupted. So when someone asks me something, I've got to draw on my library I've already written that were not to be published to answer. So I actually really do like when people ask me things that I can take a moment to share an answer. And it's taken me a while to grow into this. Oh, I was not ready before today for this. I'm actually ready today. So I'm doing that for the first time live here. I am honored, sister. And Hilla said, one of the natural ways to speak is also considered light language, question mark, the vibration in which we speak. That's great for you, darling. That's terrific. That's good for you. I don't go into that gotcha. beautiful soul. You do what it is for you. I do what it is for me. I'm working with the whole collective with humanity as a grandmaster energy for the planet. So that's what it is for you. You're okay. welcome. You're so welcome. Thank you. Oh, did she just What is that? Question? Question? I did about the relationships. It's ending old karmic cycles is across the board. Again, if you watch the previous video that I did, the end of karmic cycle event, I spoke a little bit more there, strongly about this, and I will that can that answers that or the video before one of them. I answered that. Um, your choice, who you want to be with, is part of your journey. I have people I know that are married that some are staying together realizing that they're helping their husband to grow as individuals together because it's ultimately about us coming home to our inner masculine feminine being our own twin flame firstly and we're changing into we're coming out of the marriage paradigm and we're into separate souls first and then you choose to be with people so there's too much to answer any more than that. Please watch yesterday's and see if that can give you a bit more. It's, that's I can only give briefly on that because it's pretty deep. Yes. There's not one answer for what a lot of people say. What a lot of people say, you've got to give me a moment because it's multifaceted. Yes, I was going to say that's multidimensional. So what may an answer for one person might be something different for another. So that's why yeah, I don't get involved in anything personally. I come back from a bigger picture and give them the highest answer from the source pure. It's taken me quite a century to grow into. It's taken a long time. No one can take that away from me. So there's no rush. There's no competition. There's no negative ego. There's no jealousy. Just pure divine unconditional love. And we unite like we're doing here today. We are the event. There is no one event. I just call mine the event because that's what people's eyes and that's what the terms the outside world uses. Woohoo, I've been doing events for fucking years. You know? This is old hat for me. This is not new for me. What's new and exciting for me, because I've been through the ascension that you each going through into 5D. I did that 10, about 13, 15 years ago. So it's easy. Lisa Transcendence Brown also said that once too. She said, I've done where you're at. And I went, I could see that she had. And I'm saying the same thing. I've done being where you're at in leading and bringing what I am firstly, but I'm still here pushing my sleeves up, learning to be a grandmaster energy and bringing new platforms and yee this is where the fun fucking begins. Amen to that. And I want to tell you too, you know, in um, connecting to that, you know, um, connecting with you, um, talking about going to the grandmaster energies, you know, just connecting to you was, and that's what it's about is finding the people to connect to when you are ready to up level to your next mastery and you'll find Can that. you feel i'm gonna jump in take a breath in a moment i asked you were you willing breathe release i want you to feel every chakra in your body going through an upgrade right now i'd love you to breathe and release breathe and release i know it's your show and i did say to Don't you right at the beginning will you allow me to do a healing on you in the show no. yes breathe release breathe and release spirit to soul spirit to soul Spirit to soul, breathing released, live with all these energy, all your chakras are going through an upgrade. You're struggling, keep your eyes closed, keep going. Show others how to do it. Keep your eyes closed, keep your eyes closed, Master. This is how we roll. We roll and we're live, live through your energy centers. We shift them from chakras because that was a very negative way to control us in the past. So we learned to shift and to call them energy centers because it's softer. There we go. There we go. Mother Mary Essence just came through you right there. Stop. Thank you. Thank you. Woo. Thanks for being raw and real, showing up and allowing me to gift you the healing. So many people are too will resist, will just whatever. 
thank you so much for receiving. But isn't it time for that to be wrong? We are wrong. Oh, we're beyond words now. I just keep saying we're beyond words. That's okay. I've been blue beyond guide for some time. So I was always ahead. I was ready. I was here prepared, waiting, waiting for me to catch up, really, not anyone else, because it's an individual journey, you know, like you. I had to grow into this as well, but I'm kick ass. Well, soft and emotional, vulnerable, I'm kick ass as well. You've yes. got to be your. Well, thank you for allowing me. No, I should thank you for holding the space so I could jump into my new door and my up level. I held it and you just took you a few goes to come in, come in and accept graciously. And that's the biggest gift telling you can give everybody. Yes. Because you I just clear that energy. And these shows from now on, you just push through all that energy. You've got to clear yes. run from here energetically. And I open for everyone else to take that step as well because it is new to Ah, me. that's very interesting. Let me sit back and listen. Good one. Okay. It's open. Say it, can you say it again? Can you say that again? You ask everyone else to be open. Inviting everyone else to be open to take that next level, to walk through the next door, to show up at another level. Wow. Feel this is how Jesus rolled. Master teaching and healing together. They are here to be. You bet. And rise that vibration to the next level that the world oh, needs right yes. now. Yes. I felt you then. I felt you so beautifully, strongly with all your chakras then from when we first came on to shift, 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 shift. You've risen your vibration live. We've got to keep acknowledging. We always, I always share. I'm always growing. Yesterday I grew a bit more. I learned something about myself. And, you know, others keep that and only give and perform and show this model thing that they've got all their shit fucking together. None of them have their fucking shit together. I fucking promise you. Not one. And when they say you, they do. <laughs> no comment. Exactly. I think I lost you. Yeah. Oh, there you are. You're back. Okay. It's just what up. Yeah. We had a lag. lag. Yeah. It's all good. Yeah, we're, 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 we're bringing through some amazing energies right now. So we are uniting and we're ending all karmic energy cycles. Pardon? I said, that's what happens when you up level. <laughs> yeah. I'm, I'm just being let know that those dark underground energies were dark old sisterhood witch jealousy competitive dark witch energies that we're clearing some underneath lines underneath underneath for the planet yes and it's going around in a spiral And we just release those old energy. So, what a blessing to be here with you today. Oh. And everyone else that's come in as well. Blessing as well, my sister. Magical, 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 magical times. See? That's what I used tonight. Oh, I am freaking magical. <laughs> What'd you do? So, Let's see what else we got. Some comments. The energy flowing are intense and beautiful and so powerful. Thank you, Caroline Hillis. Man, my feet are so fuzzy now. Um, Good. Donna, wow, resonating. Wondrous energy clearing. Fabulous, Rhonda. Thank you. Uh, what else is coming through? Magical. Love it, Rachel. So thank you guys for buzzing along with us. Oh, my gosh. This has been so much fun. So much fun. Blessings. Ah, to this you, is your beginning. We are ancient here. Oh, I know. This is just the beginning. Oh, we ain't finishing here, girl. You're gonna, you're gonna want this, sister. You're gonna want a bit of this love and mama. <laughs> you're gonna get me back home, <laughs> so we can love up on each other. Yes, and and, and just 
it's easy in unconditional love to fully accept others in all their facets and just breathe and give them some space and just we're all freaks we're all unusual we're all quirky that's our strength it is i, I don't rock it like a rock star i know like a rock star they don't know what have a look what fucking russell brand has gotten away with <laughs> ricky gervais oh, yeah <laughs> jim carrey <laughs> they're fucking up everyone's faces with their comedy and they just say whatever they want and it's beautiful sorry i i appreciate facets of each of those people's energies and um a little bit along those lines myself is all i will say yes yes and i'm just up yeah. so who knows what the hell i'm gonna uh, tra uh transform into <laughs> I knew you, you're already here. There's nothing else to do. <laughs> I'm just going to keep loving you and shifting the old shit and you're just going to glow and flow. And I can't wait to see where you go from here with this and what's going to be up to you from spirit from today with us here. Yeah. Thank you. I must still be waiting to open receive all that because you got a little messed up there, but... You with me? I'm breathing it in. I'm breathing it in. <laughs> I lost you for a second. I think we lost Anastasia for a second. Watch the rape. Play oh, she's back. You'll hear what, what I said. That is I know. so funny. I'm going to open to receive it. I'm going to open to receive it. I promise. I promise. Of course you did. <laughs> Don't, don't you love it's when not, that shit happens? The energy to receive at all. <laughs> okay, you're gonna clear this. Come back, Anastasia. Come back. Uh, Did she uh, freeze? Am I back? Back? A little bit. You're a little muffled. I don't know. Maybe they're seeing you perfect. Are you there? Can you guys see our, um, Anastasia? If you could let us know. You'll see something. Every always something that happens. Always, always. We're so freaking much. I think you come. So, um, why don't you let us, uh, everyone who's listening, who maybe hasn't heard about you tomorrow or you before, and just like tuning in now or later on on YouTube. Uh, no muffled. No, no muffled. I guess she's saying no, cutting out. So you are cutting out a little bit, but we're going to clear that energy. Actually, let me, I'm going to take you off and bring you back on a second. Maybe that'll, that maybe that'll reboot you. Hold on. We're going to reboot you. Okay. Let's reboot her. Are you back? I think you're still muffled. Can you move around the computer? Not you. <laughs> I can't hear you. I think she got, I think she got, um, I don't think we can hear her. Still, she's still, uh, oh, there you are. Are you coming back? Yeah, I don't think, I think we're gonna have to finish, wind it up. Okay, well, how about this? Okay, real quick while we got you, why don't you um, go ahead and just tell how do people get in contact with you? I mean, people that, yep, you know, don't know, haven't listened to you before. And then I'll do some sound. What would you like me to do? Oh, do you just want to let people know how to contact uh, to you? The people are saying the energies are too intense. Anastasia's fuzzy. It's her glow. It's her glow. <laughs> Everybody understands. So just feel the energy of what Anastasia is saying right now. I, so we're, okay. Uh, wait, yeah. Here she comes. <laughs> uh, sounds beautiful. I just wanted to also share if you can hear me that number eight, eight, eight. she's talking about 888 and 777 but i'm not exactly sure what she's saying so okay 
We heard okay. It's all good. Yes. <laughs> I think you're, we're losing your Anastasia. Right. So how did um happen? The blue one died on Facebook. With every right huh? video show something happened. Hi vibing sister, hi vibing. It's what happens, you know. The bandwidth can't handle it. <laughs> I can hear you now. Oh, somebody said you went to 12D. You're still fuzzy. <laughs> but number oh my god. Eight, 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 mate. I also suggest that a phase in your life is about to end and is a sign of warning to enable you to prepare yourself and your life accordingly. It may indicate you are winding up an emotional career or relationship phase in your, your life. Beautiful. Is everybody feeling the energy of that? You were kind of in and out. I don't know if you can hear me, All right. but I'm done. That, what came through came through. I don't know if you can hear me not. But we're at 856. So if everybody goes to YouTube later on, there's a description with her contact information. And so what we're going to do, Anastasia, since <clears throat> contact and oh, here we go. Chris said contact Anastasia at Blue Beyond Guide on Facebook. So thank you, Chris, for that lovely information. So Blue Beyond Guide Facebook. Oh, she's back. Page. Blue Beyond Guide.com. It is. I think we got some through Blue Anastasia. Bluebeyondguide.com so website. Beautiful. So it's bluebeyondguide.com website <laughs> is where you can contact Anastasia. <laughs> Good on you. And YouTube, Blue Beyond Guide. It's all Blue Beyond Guide. Yeah. Okay. Just search the Blue Beyond Guide and you'll find Anastasia. <laughs> <laughs> well, we're going to, um, I'm right. going to say thank you, Anastasia. Oh, God. For huh? Thank you. Stay on for one, stay on for a second. I'm going to give everybody a nice sound to clear the energies for the end. Since Anastasia, I want to thank her from the bottom of my heart. She will be back. We will do this again. Who knows when, when spirit calls it in. But I appreciate everyone this evening. Heart love to everyone. Thank you for joining me at the Cosmic Tune-Up Happy Hour. You, the This video will be live on YouTube so you can see it. And I appreciate everyone. I love everyone. And I'm just going to end the show with a little bit of sound to clear the energy. So I want everybody here just to take a deep breath in and just settle into yourself, settle into all the beautiful energies that came through all the healing that came through this evening and just put your hand on your heart. And we're just going to zap the rest of it out to open your space up. Take a deep breath in, put your hand on your heart, a hand on your stomach, say your name to yourself, bring yourself back home to you and feel you. Much love to everyone. Thank you for joining the Cosmic Tune-Up. Good night.